from the ashes. Or book I. Chapter one. Philip. The year of our Lord, 1135, had come to an end. King Henry of England, son of William the Conqueror, had died. It was a time of poverty and death. In their despair, some had come to believe Christ and all his saints had gone to sleep. And that the pillars of the earth themselves had begun to crumble. But a game. They already said the name of the game. Is there no one to welcome us? Who goes there? You just crossed the bridge, right? That'll be a farthing for you and a penny for your horse. Monks and villagers don't have to pay a toll. Ah, sorry, I'm not good at this. I told Brother Paul. It's not easy doing the Lord's work when you're hungry. It is not much, but I can share this with you. Did he take a whole round of cheese? That was a lot. I just gave him my cheese. I hope now it will be easier for you to fulfill your duties. Oh, I'm sure it will. Will you take care of my horse, brother? I've come to see Prior James. Prior James? That's him the bells are tolling for. Leave the horse here. I'll get it down to the Priory later. The fish should go nicely with that cheese. What? Why are they ringing the bells? Don't you know? The devil has come to Kingsbridge. The devil has come to Kingsbridge? Oh no, you can use Philip's Bible on objects to find out what the Bible tells Philip about them. You can use it on people to discuss matters of faith. All right. shows me if I can actually interact with it if it's fully round. It has the it has both sides of the mouse. That's actually this is some clever design here. Like this is some clever ass design. Like the dot it shows you left and right. If the left is 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 solid then you can interact with it. If the right is you can look at it. Like, wow. That is clever. What if I interact with my horse? Okay. I just I just give it a give it a pet. Yeah, a new game. We're a robot master and now we're in the twelfth century. Where we can't even do any ma robot mastering. It's kind of a shame, really. Is this us? Are we here? Oh, 
this is our progress. Okay, cool. Let's go to the monastery, I guess. Oh, we can't go there. Oh, there we can go to the gate, though. Hello? Oh, there we are. Hmm. I'm sure there was someone moving behind a window. But most houses are empty. Why didn't I bring my horse in here? is okay with that. Look at the stables. Oh. <laughs> Apparently, it's stinky. I'm guessing. Cloister. This doesn't look good. This place looks, um, not good. When he opened the salt seal, I looked, and behold, there was a great earthquake, and the sun became black as sackcloth. The moon became like blood, and the stars of the sky fell to the earth, as the big tree sheds its winter fruit when she Thou shalt not be afraid of the terror by night. Here's everybody. Nor of the pestilence that walketh in darkness. The pestilence that rode in on the lightning that struck our cathedral four years ago. Did you not all feel its presence here ever since? James did. These guys look and fine. I yeah. did as well. But the Lord says. Or if they have an onion on set their his love upon me, therefore will I deliver him. Our beloved Prior James has served the Lord all his life. He shall be delivered from the darkness. From this dark earth. It may have been the style. Prior uh, James. Philip. Francis? Shh. For many years, James has been our prior. After the upcoming election, I vow to lead Kingsbridge Priory with the same steady hand. I guess he's dead. Amen. Is he dead? The art style of this game is interesting and fairly unique. Philip, we told your brother you'd come to Kingsbridge New Year's Day. I did not expect to see you here. I was on my way back to Gloucester and wanted to see you priest working in the world of politics. You must tell us about it, Francis. Of course. And his brother a prior of what now? Two years? It's been four years, Cuthbert. <laughs> I see. How are things in St. John of the Forest, Philip? Better than here, in our mother house, Kingsbridge, it seems. I wanted to use my New Year's visit to talk to Prior James about this. James did the best he could, Philip. If you had been here, you would know that. I I'm sorry. I shouldn't have... No. You're right, Philip. With a limp hand on the tiller, a ship is blown about at hazard and goes nowhere. James meant well. Uh, of course he did. Please, forgive me. He meant well. Come by the kitchen later to see us, will you? Hmm. 
Brother Cuthbert seemed upset. Well, we all are. The way James died was disturbing. Okay. Disturbing? How did Prior James die? Seven days ago, Brother Remigius found James's room empty. We all looked for him for hours. Then we found his footprints by the bridge and a, a hole oh, in the ice. I remember seeing that hole. Oh no. No. In the small hours of Christmas Day, he must have walked out on the river. We didn't even find his body. The river took him. And Sounds cold. suspicious. I will pray for James. See me when you have time, Philip. I will be in the cathedral. And I should go and see how Brother Cuthbert is doing. It's good to see you, Philip. Maybe things will get better after the chapter elects the new prior. Hopefully. I will come by the kitchen later, Milius. What is Francis doing here? And where is he? So what do you think it means? I don't know. There is no reason to punish us for asking. You look like you want to ask me something. You are Philip of Gwyneth? Yes, but you can call me Brother Philip. You see? Told you he wouldn't mind. Yes. Now ask him. How about you ask him? I already asked Brother Andrew. That doesn't count. He wouldn't answer. What is it? Just ask. Brother Milius told us you know the scripture very well. Could you tell us about God's temple? Brother Andrew wouldn't tell us. It must be a place. A cathedral. That's probably what the guest master Each was talking of about. us is God's temple in the way that he created us. And what, what if someone does something to God's temple? The scripture says, if anyone destroys God's temple, God will destroy him. Even if he destroys his own temple of God? So for prior James, there's no salvation as well? Prior James did not commit suicide. But no one saw him that night. No one knows. God knows. God knows what sent him running out onto the ice. They say the devil was chasing him. Don't say his name. I have seen brave men run devil. for many reasons. Never have I seen the devil. So we should not make room for him, neither here nor in our hearts. All right? Yes, Brother Philip. Thank you, Brother Philip. Idiot. Have you seen my brother, Francis? The priest working for Robert of Gloucester? He's your brother? Your family? Yes, he is. Oh, he, he went into the cathedral, I believe. He did. I, I saw him. Thank you. You are very helpful. You are very... Well, let's go back into the cathedral, then. So, uh, again, we're all God's temple. Here's a door. Whoa, look at all that stuff. There's candles. Nothing here is in order. What a waste. Main gate. All right, let's look around in here. We're adventuring, kind of. Hey, there he is. Well, what do you know?
Francis, you look troubled. You could always read me. Like a book, little brother. It's good to see you, Philip. Like a book! King Henry is dead. I know. Word reached St. John shortly before I left. First the King, and now Prior James. The devil has come to Kingsbridge. What? Uh, just something I heard. Something foolish. And yet, these are dark times indeed. King Henry's death caused quite a commotion in the world of politics. There will be war. Uh, uh, okay. Francis's note about the late King Henry. Part one. For many years, our late King Henry has been without an heir. His only, his only legitimate son, as well as several other relatives, had drowned while crossing the English Channel one night in 1120. Finally, his daughter, Maud, <coughs> gave birth to a boy. And it was Henry's last wish that his infant grandson would continue his reign as Henry II once the boy came of age. And until that day, his mother, the daughter of the king, would rule in his place. Despite being the rightful heir to the throne, Empress Maud is viewed unfavorably by most of our Norman overlords. The reason Maud is Ma, the reason is Maud's marriage to Geoffrey of Anjou, the uh, country of Anjou, and the Duchy of Normandy had been uh, rivals for a long time. A rivalry that now is about to become a war, taking place right here in England. For Maud's cousin Stephen of Blois is now uh, crossed the channel from Normandy and taken the throne. By force. Okay. If only we could stop the suffering. Maybe we can. I came not just to meet you. Oh, yeah. I was sent to look for a messenger of my lord, Earl Robert. Here? In Kingsbridge? Farmers said the messenger was heading for Kingsbridge two weeks ago. The knight was carrying a confidential document that might change the course of the conflict. People here trust you. Maybe the monks here know something? We will find him. One more thing. No one can know why we're looking for the knight. It's confidential. It's secret. It's secret. It's secret. Nobody can know. Nobody can know. What's over here? Oh. Well, I can't get in here. Probably. Locked. Bet you that's where he is. She's down there. That's where I would be. That's where I would be. If I were a knight. I was hiding. I would be right there. All of us. Because... Brothers, have you two heard about a knight visiting Kingsbridge? The Earl of Shiring was here, and some of his knights. And many other nobles at Christmas. It would have been a lone rider. A messenger? I don't think so. If someone had come to Kingsbridge, Brother Paul would have seen him. Uh, Brother Paul went back out to his toll hut. I see. Thank you. Guess we'll go back out there. That's a good point. It's a because good God point. God created us in his image. Mm. You know? This priory is so much bigger than our small Is that my horse? Forest. Oh, look at that map. We got a map. We got a map. Oh, yeah. Good stuff. Hey, that's, that is my horse. Let's 
Sucking Brother Paul. Why are you outside? It's cold. Brother Paul? Philip. Ah, ouch. Oh. What's wrong with your foot, Brother Paul? Oh, just a chill, Blaine. It will ease when the spring comes. You should have a fire. I it's feel like you right. should be wearing shoes. It's not that cold. Don't take it lightly. Many will die this winter for lack of food or shelter. Remigius thinks the Lord is testing us. Only the sinners perish. No, the poor perish. For and socks. those that he has freezing out here. Don't say anything to Remigius, will you? If he thinks I've been complaining, he'll be displeased. Have you heard about a knight in Kingsbridge? A knight? Yes. He was just lying by the road, just a mile away from the priory. He must have fallen from his horse. Where is he now? He died. We buried him in the cemetery. Did he have a name? Did he say anything? Oh, he could not speak. But the look in his eyes told me he was afraid. I held his hand and prayed with him while he died. Did the knight have anything with him? Uh, there was a letter. I gave it to Prior James. Remedius will probably burn it with the rest of James's papers. James insisted that all his books and documents shall be burnt after his death, except for his Bible. What? The new prior will need those documents? Sometimes I wonder if it was because of that letter. A few days later, Prior James fell through the ice. Right here. Philip, maybe I brought a curse on It's Kingsbury. murder. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord. Plans to prosper you and not to harm you. Have faith in the Lord, Brother Paul. You did well. Thank you, Philip. Mm, that's suspicious. I declare that suspicious. Very, very suspicious. I think James, he was murdered. I pray for you that when you stand before God, he will look upon you I mean, with mercy. I think we're supposed to draw that conclusion, but you know. Mm. This priory is so much bigger than our small cell in the forest. I think it's locked. Hey, look at these sheep. Why is this locked? That's why we can all pray to him. We don't need to go to church for that. No, we are the temple. But why a church then? What we have to ask ourselves is, can our Saint Adolphus still protect Kingsbridge in these dark times? He couldn't protect Prior James. Ever since that lightning struck the cathedral, he wasn't the same. When you take over my position as sacrist, you should implore the bishop to send us a new relic. By then, I'll be sub-prior. The new prior and I will support you in this. A new relic might also attract more pilgrims. Philip of Gwyneth, I wanted to talk to you. How dare you disturb Brother Remedius Requiem? I'm... I'm afraid the choir is waiting for me. Stay, brother. There's no reason you shouldn't hear what Philip has to say for himself. I, 
I was shocked by the prior's death. We all were. I'm sure at St. John's you're a good prior, but here we adhere to the rules. You mentioned a new prior. The election will be held in a few days, when we all convene for the chapter meeting. I'm not supposed to ask about the letter. Let so us continue won't. this conversation later. Of course. Uh, there's a lot of planning for me to do so for we the won't. upcoming election. I think we may have to yoink it. Okay, we can't do Why anything do in there. Draw? Why do we create temples if we are the temple? Isn't it almost arrogant to try and... Brother Ronaldus, how are you? Huh? What? Looks like he could be bad. How are you? Are you well? Oh, Brother Philip. Yes, I am well. It's just that the dead won't stay in the ground. What? The dead. It's probably those badgers always digging up the graves. Jerks. Stupid badgers. It's, it's the night. I wonder if he says knee. Probably. Well, he doesn't anymore. If he did, at any time. <clears throat> he, he definitely doesn't anymore. I asked not to be disturbed. Brother Remigius, I'm sorry I interrupted your service. You mean Prior James's service? Quite so. I heard he fell through the ice. Horrible. Yes. I was the one who found his rosary by the river. Now let me continue my work. That's suspicious. Why would Prior James walk out onto the river at night? He was chased. Chased? By whom? The accuser. But why would the devil be chasing him? Better to not get involved in all this. Hmm? Don't you have your own priory cell to run? I would like to take a look at Prior James's documents. And why is that, Brother Philip? Well, uh, our little cell has given much to the Mother House. I would like to ensure that all is accounted for. So you do not trust us, Philip, is that it? The state of this Priory... The state of this priory is the concern of the Prior of Kingsbridge. I still would like to see the Prior's documents. They will be burned tonight. I heard about that. It was Prior James's last wish. I'm following his request. But the new Prior will be lost without the ledgers and contracts. After the election, I'll be the new prior. For now, you are not. Only the chapter meeting can decide on these matters. Of course. 
Brother Andrew will surely understand why you would go against James's last request. <laughs> Mm. Okay. If you really want to be of help, look for Brother Cuthbert's keys. He's getting old. Yeah, Miss we should punch him in the back the of the time. head. Hmm. I'll ask about you the devil. Really believe the devil killed the prior? Some of the brothers do, and I respect their beliefs. We may never know what happened, and that's that. He now let it. me get back to my work. About the chapter meeting. Oh. Talk to Brother Andrew. He will be just as pleased as me to have you around. Now leave. I wish I could just keep bothering him, but I can't. Okay, I can't do anything in that room either. All right, good to know. Let's go this way. Oh, this goes here, okay. All right, well, I guess let's go to the kitchen. Hello, Brother Milius. Come. Warm yourself by the oven. Is that Philip? Tell him to warm himself by the oven. Thank you, Brother Cuthbert. Mmm, fish. Let's warm ourselves by the ah, oven. Wonderful. I always put some extra stones on the stove to warm up water. Put one in your pocket, and you'll keep warm. Oh? They're hot. Ouch. Don't do that. You'll burn your fingers off. Oh. Ouch. No, that's all I meant to do. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I kind of deserve that one. Nice and warm, and I didn't burn my hands, Milius. I knew you could do it. I'm so smart. I'm the smartest. Milius, why do you keep a beautiful pot like this around? Oh, it's a uh, hot job coming through. Strive for order and beauty. I started collecting some seeds and nuts because I wanted to start a new garden. A good idea. I never got around to collecting more, though. If you find some, let me know. Okay, I have some. I found some beech nuts. Ah, we will grow a beech tree then. Wonderful. If we ever get around to starting the garden. I'm sure you will. Remigius told me to have Andrew arrange a chapter meeting. That's the only way to save James's documents. Then there's hope. But Brother Andrew is stubborn. You'll have to be stubborn too when you talk to him. Hard at work, as usual, Milius? I have to serve salt fish six times a week now. We hear you have fresh fish every day at your cell in the forest. Every other day, we even have poultry. You have done wonderful work at St. John's Philip. Poultry?
We, on the other hand, had a weak prior for 13 years. May the Lord rest his soul. What you worked hard for at St. John's is wasted here in the Mother House. After I mean, the election, the new prior ought to put things right. Remedius, put things right. Maybe we underestimate Remedius. He's about to burn all the books and documents in the prior's room, including the priory's ledgers. Regis says James asked for everything to be burnt after his death, except for his Bible. So I've heard. Without the ledgers, the Priory's finances will be beyond saving. Corruption. Wait, who asked me to get the... No, not... Was no one else nominated? Only Cuthbert. I refuse. I'm too old. No one else dares to follow in Prior James's footsteps. Not since he began talking to the devil. The devil! He's talking what? to Flanders. One day he started talking to the devil, as if they were standing side by side. You know it was the devil. He was bargaining with the devil for his soul, whispering about his sins. His sins? Mm. Right. Did you see a knight in Kingsbridge? You mean, aside from the nobles attending the Christmas service? No, I don't remember any knights visiting us. Okay, leave. We'll talk more later. I'm not supposed to talk about the letter. Don't talk about the letter. Don't say that. Why not? We wouldn't be here if it weren't for the cathedral. We can't allow Prior James's books to be burned. That, Philip, was Prior James's wish. This priory is in debt. And without the ledgers and documents, that will never change. Besides, the wisdom in his books is priceless. It is not up to you to make decisions in this priory, Brother Philip. Silence! Your self-indulgence is inexcusable. If you don't see why this priory needs those ledgers, you are a poor choice as a sub-prior. Oh. My one and only concern is the well-being of Kingsbridge. If that is true, I won't stand in your way to argue your case in front of the chapter. Yeah. When I'm done here, I will tell all the monks to come to the chapter house. Would it help if I went and told some of them? I feel free to do that. But I insist that the choir finishes practicing before we start. They're already behind schedule. Get wrecked, nerd. I, I, I don't think I wrecked him, but I did say. It feeds us. You're being. You're being a we dang are is. Of God. I can't talk to them. Who am I supposed to talk to? Yeah, we need to eat too. I need to talk we to brothers. To Apparently they the don't count. Don't so do the nobles. I see. They don't count. The temple to feed the temple. Oh, yes. I need to talk to the kitchen people, I guess. No, no, no. I mean, I'm sure. 
There was something. He's right. You seem troubled, brother. They won't... They won't sing. It's Adolphus. Mm. There was nothing, believe me. I heard him crying in the crypt. I think I heard him too. No, you are mistaken. It sounded like a whip, like he was chastising himself. It's the end of days. Brother Philip, please help me. Prove to them that there is nothing and no one down there. Now stop it. Concentrate. There it was again. <gasps> I fear the crypt has been locked. Then get the key. Brother Cuthbert should have it. Oh, okay. <clears throat> there it was again. All right. Okay, must I know where the down. key is now. That's good. Cathedral. We must. Did you not hear it? I think it might be the former prior, actually. I don't I'm not convinced he's dead. I think I heard it again. Uh, it's getting cold. When will these novices learn to close the door? Maybe he is the Brother devil. Cuthbert. Ah, we were waiting for you. I hope you brought some of that wonderful cheese you make at St. John's. I, uh, I gave it to one of your novices. Why would you do that? He said, it's not easy doing the Lord's work when you're hungry. Greedy brother Marcus. You are too trusting, Philip. I'm sorry for how I talked to you about the Priory earlier. It's just that at St. John's, we worked hard to become self-sufficient. We have given so much to Kingsbridge, our mother house. And the priory here is in a horrible state. Don't you think I know that? Ah. We should be rich. The priory has much land and collects from many parish churches. But we are in debt. Our novices steal from us, Philip. What? The novices are stealing? Yes. Someone took my keys. Remigius blames me for losing them. But someone used them to steal food from the cellar more than once. Today I found something missing again. He doesn't have the keys. Let us continue another time, Brother Cuthbert. Of course. He doesn't have the keys, so that's great. All right, well. What are these kitchen utensils? I saw something about kitchen utensils. There they are. You keep everything nice and tidy around here, Milius. It's not easy. This morning, one of my ladles broke. That's never a good sign. Everything is falling apart. Oh, I thought I was gonna, like, take one or something. All right, I need to find the keys, apparently. Well, guest house. Can't go there. Yeah, 
Maybe he's seen the keys. And then there's these guys out here. Rotten edges. We used to eat them. Now, they're eating us. I'm sure it's not their preferred meal. My father gave the Priory a good deal of land to keep me fed. I won't eat salted fish all day. Me neither. Shall we go into the cellar again tonight? Yes, Brother Marcus. You still have old Cuthbert's keys? Indeed I do. I hid them right in the church. Stuffed them in the large crack in the wall. I could do some crack stuff in myself. <laughs> I bet you could. All right. Well, I guess he wasn't wrong. I, I don't. I, I don't know what he meant by doing some crack stuff. And there, I heard it. There was something. The novice said He's he right. hid the keys in here. Now stop it. Concentrate. They're here. I have them. Once again. Yeah. <gasps> this brother Marcus really did steal Cuthbert's keys. What a jerk. What do you think we're gonna find down here? Anything? Let's see what we can find. No reason to be afraid. Nothing. These old cathedrals are bound to make strange sounds. Hello? No, no one. Not a thing. It's spooky. Thought so. Nothing here. Hello? to know that I should tell them I hope I didn't poop my pants the saint rests in peace did you not hear it there is no need to worry brothers Adolphus is resting in peace it was just an owl I told you it was nothing. God bless you, Brother Philip. I knew I heard something. Now, be silent, concentrate, and... Yay, we did it. Brother Andrew has arranged a meeting. Yes? Please go ahead. We will be there in a few minutes. Okay, I guess I need to tell... What, what about you? Can I tell you? The sacrist agreed to a meeting today. That way I might be able to get the letter you were looking for. 
Good thinking, Philip. I will attend, of course. All right. I gotta go to the kitchen, I guess, until then. Go around here. Kitchen. There will be a chapter meeting today. Excellent. I can't wait to see you and Remigius quarrel. Brother Cuthbert? Do not worry. We are on your side. <laughs> oh, and here's your keys. Cuthbert, I believe I found your keys. Where did you find them? The thief hid them in the cathedral. That is a sacrilege. Will you report the thief to Remigius, Brother Philip? I will think about it. Keep them until we know what to do, will you? You, you probably overheard me, but... There will be a chapter meeting today. You convinced Andrew? Miracles do happen. We will be there. You have our support. Who else do I need to tell? Oh, maybe the guy at the front. The guy in front, maybe. Maybe he needs to be told. This guy, <clears throat> Brother Paul. <clears throat> there will be a chapter meeting soon. Ah, thank you for letting me know, Philip. Ah, oh, my foot. It's too cold for you here. It's given this rock. Here, Paul. Oh, ouch. Oh. <laughs> A hot stone. <laughs> ah, <laughs> it's a mercy, Philip. Thank you. Remedia should give you a fire, or not have you sit here at all. I don't really mind. Winter is bound to end sometime. Philip, if you ever run into trouble with Remedius, be careful to answer him. Do not stay silent. Silent. Nothing makes him angrier than someone who doesn't answer. He becomes weak and defensive. It's not fitting for a sub-prior, let alone prior. Okay. <clears throat> now what? Building by the fields. That's the hint thing. What's over here? Road toward north. I can't go there. Can't go there. I can go toward the building. I don't quite understand why. Oh, maybe the keys work on this. They do indeed. Okay. Worst charges in the old mill. Brothers, I have to leave. I have not found God to be here with you. The cane of sub prior will shall <clears throat> Regimus shall never again hit my back. Never again. May I still find God elsewhere. Okay. Alright. Mill works. Yeah, we found that. We found some farewell message. And that's it. That's all that's here. Alright. Well, we, 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 we went we went in. We saw... Wait, wait, wait. 
manger. Shabby manger. Waste of cloth. Okay. Maybe you have to tell them. There will be a chapter meeting in a few minutes. Oh, yes. We will be there. Thank you for letting us know. Oh, okay. We have to tell them, too. I didn't think we could because we can't talk to them, but... Oh, we have to tell him too, don't we? Brother Alnaldus. There's a chapter meeting today. Today, I'll be there. Wouldn't miss that. Careful, Brother Cuthbert will get in trouble if I lose them. Alright, well. A waste of time. A waste of time. We should go to Shiring sometime. Heard they have a big titted harlot there. One that would even do you. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> <laughs> We'll contemplate this later. Not now. Okay, well, we can't... A waste of time. We seem to not be able to tell them. I think I've told everybody except them. Oh, wait, I haven't told him. What is it? Can you not see that I'm working? Brother Marcus stole Cuthbert's keys. Oh, Brother Marcus. I will deal with him. You were right to report this to me. Theft is something we cannot take lightly. Not sure if that was a good idea, but... About the chapter meeting. Oh. Talk to brother and now be. Oh, I guess I can't tell him. Okay. About the keys that were stolen by brother Marcus. I will deal with him. Well, he's gonna get in trouble. I, I don't really feel that bad about it, honestly. He took my cheese too. He took my cheese. Like, he took my cheese. Okay, that's everybody, right? I don't think there's anybody left. The choir has finished singing. The cantor should find time now. Are you ready for the chapter meeting, Brother Philip? If you have any other business to take care of in Kingsbridge, do it now. The meeting could take a long time. Let's do it. The chapter meeting is more important. Than all my other crap that I got going on. Ooh. And this is why Prior James's wish must not be honored. Kingsbridge Priory would be beyond saving without financial records. I think we have all understood the reason for your concern, Brother Philip. But before we come to a decision, let us hear other voices of concern. I would like to know why you would doubt the wisdom in Prior James's decision. Maybe you didn't know him as well as we did, Philip. 
I can say I knew him well. We all here knew him. How wise was Prior James, really? Philip, you are going too far. I will tell the bishop about this. Brothers, oh, let him smile. Brothers, please. Oh, wow. Let's oh, hear let what he has speak. to say. Oh, heavens. He has a tendency to do that. He lost his temper with me as well. And with me. Will you lose your temper again now, Philip? Well, I'm about to. Shush, Melius. I owe James much. He was the one who asked me to take care of St. John in the forest. One of the most prosperous cells in all of Shiring, if not England. It was a wise decision, then. But his last wish was not. Well, was it? What are you waiting for? Answer me! Maybe none of you truly knew Prior James. <gasps> Who does he think he is? May the Lord forgive him. He knows not what he is saying. No. I have taken offense to Philip's words myself today. Sometimes, Brother Philip ought to temper his words. But there is always truth in them. From some of you, I have heard that the devil walked by the prior's side. That James was followed by the accuser. Tell me, why? Why did he have to suffer? God was testing Prior James. I say the devil chased him. Do you doubt that? Do you doubt that, Philip? Surely you must have an answer. Then the devil had a hand in his last wish as well. I think it's very yes, it most certainly did it's not. All my fault. Oh, well, sure. I'm not, not so the sure. The devil. If the devil has come to Kingsbridge, we must cast him out. He has come in the ways of neglect and self-righteousness. Let us look into the books and ledgers. Let us look into the problems that have ailed Kingsbridge for I much too long. We don't need that. your meddling. Well, I suppose... I, I, dare I agree. That. <laughs> hear, hear. He is right. We should not make room for the devil. Yeah. Neither here nor in our hearts. The novices would be better advised not to speak up. Philip is a good man. He was the only one to say I should have a fire. But did he do anything besides talk? Yes. He brought me a hot stone. That's all, Philip. Very well, Philip. But why don't you tell us the real reason you have come before us? You not only came to save these books, you have another motivation, do you not? I am here only to help this priory. Uh, this priory, of course. I say it is not a coincidence that he should make his voice heard now shortly after James's passing and before the elections. What are you saying, Brother Remigius? This is not about James. It is about him. He wants to be prior. No. I came here to talk to James. I think that is a wonderful idea. I nominate Philip of Gwyneth to no. be the new prior of Kingsbridge. Eh? Oh, I can't yes. disagree with that. Well, yes, obviously. Eh, much more. Excellent choice. Or what about Remedius? That's surprising. Great Prime idea. Philip. Get right Brother Philip, do you accept the nomination? <laughs> oh, that's funny. Thank you for your kind offer, but we would not want to impose on you, Brother Remigius. Oh, but, but I insist. I will help you. No, you really must not. We will see you later. Thank you.
We don't have much time. Evening mass will begin soon. <clears throat> Should I not have accepted the nomination? You've never been good at saying no. And Milius is right. Kingsbridge needs you. What about St. John's? I will ride there tomorrow. I will let them know you will be staying in Kingsbridge for a few days. Thanks to you, these documents and books will not be burned. Now, we have to find that choice. You truly think the letter can help prevent a war? If the message says what I think it says, then yes, I do. Okay. Our new king, Stephen, is supported by most of our Norman overlords and even by the church. His younger brother, Henry, is Bishop of Winchester and one of the most important priests in all of England. He made uh, Stephen swear an oath to reserve power to the church, which had little influence on political affairs under King Henry. A good day for the church and for us. The trouble is that my lord, Earl Robert, is one of the king's bastards. He wants to see his half-sister bawd on the throne believing she would heavily rely on his guidance and advice during her reign. In the name of Empress Baud, he and his allies have formed a rebellion against King Stephen. Not long now, and there will be war. Now, let us look for the letter. Alright. Looking for the letter. The handwriting on this tablet is hardly legible. Whoever sheds the blood of man, by man shall his blood be shed. That's not it. Did Prior James write this? Let's continue looking. I asked a question and you just ignored me, dude. That was not nice. James spent much time writing in the last ten years. Instead of a prior, he became more of a recluse. That is what you monks do, isn't it? It used to be. Prior James was working on a text. Our God is a consuming fire, and whom he destroyed shall be raised at the end of days, and shall destroy him. The first line is from the scripture, but I do not believe the second one is. Philip, we must focus on the letter. I'm working on it, jeez, man. Just, just let me, let me look. The writing here is strangely distorted and illegible. But it must be James's writing. Age can be a troublesome burden. Hmm. Hmm. Francis, I think I found it. In the Bible? Revelations. The Apocalypse of St. John. And they called to the mountains and rocks fall on us and hide us from the face of him who is seated on the throne and from the wrath of the lamb for the great day of their wrath has come hmm. and who can stand the bible wasn't to be burnt the lamb what was james afraid of was it this letter no the letter is still sealed break the seal Letter dated. Name the day and we will be ready to shed blood in the name of Empress Maud. I and my bondsmen will ride against Stephen of Leos. Blow, blow, blow is. We, we do not, we do not start the war, but we shall unleash it. Stephen himself started it in, started it the day he betrayed the King Henry's daughter and took her throne. He and those who swore loyalty to him. Oh, this is it. You found it. 
The Earl of Shiring is about to start a war? Yes. He's made contact with my own master, Earl Robert of Gloucester. Who is this King Stephen that has taken the throne? A nephew of King Henry. Do you ever think of the day our parents died? Francis, you know I don't like to talk of that. I know. It's just that I think of them all the time. And I've always blamed King Henry. The church suffered under his rule as much as we did in Wales. Philip, you have to show this letter to the Bishop of Kingsbridge. Why me? Because you have to. There's no other way. Our late King Henry was opposed to Rome's influence in England. King Stephen, on the other hand, swore to preserve the rights and privileges of the church, and we can help him if you tell the bishop to protect Stephen. You want the bishop to help the new king, King Stephen? I want a king who supports the church. I want these dark times to end. I want to stop the Earl of Shiring from starting a war. He could set the whole of England on fire. My lord, the Earl of Gloucester, can never know what I was doing here. You must not tell the truth about how or where you got this letter. Don't tell anyone I was involved. Do you really think the bishop will help? Tell him you found the letter by coincidence. And if he does not believe me, what then? He will believe you. The question is, will he really try to stop the Earl of Shiring? I will write to St. John's and tell your monks you will stay in Kingsbridge until the election. What if the Earl of Shiring finds out what I'm doing? What if the bishop tells him? Philip, calm down. He is your bishop. I'm a simple monk. Who am I to talk to a bishop? Yeah. They all, the bishops can only do diagonally. Daily finish chapter one, apparently. You nominated a green to meet the bishop. You reported a thief. You gave Brother Paul a hot stone. Uh, he holds me in contempt. Found a message in the mill. I found beech nuts for the garden. Oh! Oh, and that thing went. That thing went up one.